The objective within this lesson is to solve word problems using fraction and decimal multiplication. A vial contains 20 milliliters of medicine. If each dose is one-eighth of a vial, how many milliliters is each dose? Express your answer as a decimal. Let's start by drawing a tape diagram. This is the amount of medicine that is in the vial, 20 milliliters. And we're looking at one-eighth of 20 milliliters. Where each dose is equal to a certain amount. So let's work that out. One eighth of twenty milliliters is equal to one eighth times twenty milliliters, which equals twenty eight of milliliter. Cancel, cancel. We can divide it both by four. That's five halves of a milliliter, which equals two and one half milliliters each dose. And we write it out as a decimal. Two and one half is equal to what? All right, it's equal to 2.5. Each dose is 2.5 milliliters. container holds 0.7 liters of oil and vinegar. Three quarters of the mixture is vinegar. How many liters of vinegar are in the container? Express your answer as both a fraction and a decimal. Let's start by drawing a tape diagram. This is the whole container, and the entire container holds 0.7 liters. Of that, three quarters of it is your vinegar. And that's what we're trying to solve for. And then it's the three quarters of 0 0.7 liters. That's three quarters times seven tenths. Which equals 21 fortieths. Liters. So that's my fraction. If it's addressed as a decimal, I'm going to have to go to thousandths. So we'll go 21 fortieths times 25 over 25. That gets me to thousandths. 21 times 25 is going to be equal to 525. I could work it out if you want me to. 5 times 1 is 5. 5 times 2 is 10. Place a 0. 2 times 1 is 2. 2 times 2 is 4. And then add those together. I get 525, like I was saying. So it's 525 thousandths, written as a decimal, 0 0.525 liters. liters of vinegar in the container. So always express your answer clearly. Andres completed a 5 kilometer race in 13.5 minutes. His sister's time was one and a half times longer than his time. How long in minutes did it take for his sister to run the race? Let's draw some tape diagrams. Andres took 13.5. The sister took not only the 13.5, but then another half. So 13.5 times one and a half.
so the first part is 13.5, and then the second part is 13.5 times a half. Thirteen point five times a half is thirteen point five times point five. Let's go work that out. Five regroup of two, fifteen, seventeen, seven regroup of one. Five times one is five, plus one is six. Two decimal places. So six point seven five. So the sister's time is 13.5 plus 6.75. 5, 2, 1, 20.25 20 seconds. To run the race. A clothing factory uses 1,275.2 meters of cloth to make shirts. How much cloth is needed to make three and three-fifths times as many shirts? Let's make some tape diagrams. Now, they make and they use 1,275.2 meters of cloth. Their goal is to make three and three fifths as much. Try to make three fifths here. So this first off is 3 times 1,275.2. And right here, this part is 3 fifths times 1,275.2. Let's start with that first part. 6. 15, 5, we group of 1. Nope, we group the 1 in the wrong place. 3 times 7 is 21, plus 1 is 22. 2, we group of 2. 3 times 2 is 6, plus 2 is 8. And 3 times 1 is 3. So, for our 3 times the amount of shirts, is 3,825.6. And for the 3 fifths, times... 1,275.2. We can carefully work that out. Three fifths is equal to six tenths. Six times two is twelve. Two regroup of one. Six times five is thirty. Plus one is thirty-one. One regroup of three. Six times seven is forty-two. Plus three is forty-five. Six times two is twelve. Plus four is sixteen. And six times one is six. Plus one is seven. So it's seven hundred sixty-five point one two. And when I add those two together, I get my answer. two together. So carefully adding those together, you get two, seven, zero, one, nine, five, one, four thousand five hundred ninety point seven two meters. Make sure to label.